Hello. Kerbal Space Program 2. So, I was actually noticing that in the last one, that loop around, like, well, we probably didn't get it because we didn't even have an Apple app. But, we were way below that, actually. We were, like, at 43k, I think. So, there was that. Uh, we got science for it, but we didn't satisfy the mission. So, let's do that. We got a lot of new tech. Um, I think, did I show you that? Let's show. Research and development. So we're up into stage two. Still need the tiny engines. Um, but yeah, 48 left. I think we've filled in everything else so far. Um, which, you know, probably made some mistakes. I really need these fuel lines. We'll make do. Um, but we do have some cool stuff, and we really need those. We need a lot of cool stuff. But yep, it goes right on out to the fourth tier. Extra large payloads. Alright. So, we got a lot of cool stuff to build a new ship. And that's what we need to do. So, we're building. What we're doing. Give that a second. Paul. Yep, good. Hopefully that doesn't hurt you a bit. Take a quick pause. Okay. We got this new capsule. The gumball. Three seats. Command pod. More electric charge. More this and that. Oh, also I found this. It's hidden behind the camera. How you doing? Good to see you. But, um... Let's restore those. Put that on there. But yeah. You can change particular parts. Out. Make colors. I think that, that works. Couldn't find my flag. I think I was supposed to do the flag. And it's like a burgundy. I don't know if I can make a burgundy. I don't know how to do that. This kind of looks purplish. Into the reddish. I don't know. I'll have to go study my fly. I'm not going to do that now. So anyway. How you doing? Let's build. Um, We're going to the moon. We're going to need a lot. And I've been looking at the trip planner, as they say to. That's a one-way trip. But we're going to need a bit more than that. If you look at the round trip, you know, 10,240. And that's your minimum. Uh, but, so we'd be doing this part of it. And we'd be doing that. That'll get us to the moon. And then once you get to the moon, you got to get into orbit. So there's a burn. And there's that. We're not landing. We're not taking off and going back into an orbit. So we're really just from this point skipping all the way down to here. And this we don't need. Because we're not going into an orbit. We're just falling back onto Kerbal. And we know we can do that. We did that last time. And we have, where's our thermal? This nice big shield to go on our nice big capsule. Which, should I do that thing where, does it have a jettison option? I thought there was a... An option to eject them, but I guess not. So, anyway... How I got it figured here is that we actually need, like, our minimum is 5,400. I'm pretty sure we can do that. We got a new vessel. We got bigger, rounder tanks. More better. What I'm wrestling with right now is that. It's the doubler, but it's not big enough. I got that. 
is oh and actually that's what I would need right here if I wanted to do what I'm gonna try and do that's not gonna work at all I wanted to be able to eject that after we enter But if I use this, it still leaves something behind, right? Some mass behind. I don't know if that's going to save us any weight, actually. Oh, and it went on with the burgundy. Where was I? I was looking at the thermal. What's that? We gotta think about our mass. 1.2 tons. And after it's... That's 0.8 of it burning off. So there'll still be a half a ton left that we could get rid of. However, it's 0.6 of a ton and it leaves a little behind, I think. If I use this, it doesn't. I'm just guessing, stabbing at things. The double stacker. Separates at both sides. Separates at one side. But it would separate that piece. Or everything would fall off. It should work. And save me some when I hit the ground. Because, for one, I don't have that big parachute. And for another... I really want this docking available for this craft. Not that we need it on this mission, but that's what's going on there for the next missions. The dock with another ship. Yeah. So that's how I'm playing that. This. One of those. Looks great. How about some motor action? We got the poodle. Be in orbit by then. And then... Let's get a stack going. We need some tanks. Nope, I don't have the big ones of those yet. Just these ones. And what's my biggest motor? Thrust-ish. So I got this that's um, 525 at atmosphere, the ATM. Um, 600 in vacuum, but that's the bottom stage. You're going to lose it. So, what's this? So this has the 215 in vacuum uh, for up there. It's going to be good, but it's only 110 on the floor. So we'll go with that as our maximum. Oof. That's a stick. How are we doing? Look at that. 7,000 already. Just like that, huh? Neat stuff, though. RCS. Where are my rockets? RCS rockets. Control. Command and control. No. Utility. Yeah. Well, some of these down here at the bottom. It doesn't feel right that the rocket could just go like this. Put an array down here. Not what I meant to do. How about just let that pop me back up? No. Because I'm holding apart. It wasn't because I was holding apart. It's because I'm dumb. We're not. 
snappable. Snap to it. Yeah. However, this stage is going to need more. I believe so. And where was our fuel for these? Something like that. Not what I meant, but to hit control C. It's hard to see where it's at. Oh, it's not snapping. Yep, that'll work. Probably ought to have some of those down here as well. May not use much of it really in this mission, but for docking missions, probably imagine it'll get used. Ah, oh, goodness. So that's pretty much going to be our steering. Hope that'll work. We don't have a parachute yet. Let's work that out. Can't use that. Try four of them. Hopefully we're not blocking the door. Blocking a window. That's a hatch there, I'm pretty sure. A little bit of the window there. A little bit of the window there, but... Alright. But the small ones in between. Down low. Shouldn't prevent us from getting out and doing a spacewalk if we need to. I don't think we need to. We could try it. It's got communication, right? Transfer the data. 200 million meters. This is as much as we need. We could get out to 36 gigameters. Not necessary yet. But we do need to make a probe to go to Jewel. Which we're not ready for yet because we don't even have the antenna for that. That's another thing if I hadn't mentioned that as a sidestep. That as not part of this mission but in the briefing says you know you should get a communication probe Going out to Jewel. I think that's Jewel. To orbit Jewel. And that you should use an 86 gigameter antenna. That one is 130 gigameter. That one would do. That's way down the line. I think. The one minimum that we need. Where'd it go? Oh, it's back here, probably. There it is, yeah. 86 gigameter range transmitter. We need to send one of these to Jewel. And of course, where do we find it? Right there. And that's 300, but we gotta spend another 230 just to get at that. To be able to satisfy that heads up, you know, the 
the system's big, you probably ought to start sending some satellites out there for communication purposes. Um, anyway, back to the build. Doing all right. Hmm. Save this one. I had one going that I was kind of working on. This will have to go over it because it turned out that it had pieces that I don't have. And I couldn't find where they were at to get rid of them. I'll just build it from scratch. Uh, and this is for... Oh, we're just working on it in this space. <laughs> Um, was I going to name that one? Hmm, thought I had a name for it. It doesn't show up here. I'll make up a new one. What was it? Uh, the space Y that we've been using. Be the oh, I remember it was the that'll work. Is it ready to fly just like that? That can't be right. It actually looks like it would work. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure with my calculation. <laughs> the my minimum is 5,400. This rocket looks like it'll do it. Probably needs a little bit of structural help to it. Well, what's my thrust, weight to thrust thing? That's probably not good. There we go. Yeah, that's the problem with this. It's got the Delta V if we were already in space. This isn't going to get off the launch pad. I think i got to have it's greater than one. Thrust to weight ratio is less than one. Vessel will not leave the launch pad. That's right. That's the problem with that design, that you can't just use that stick. I got plans. Let's get to it. So we're going to stick some rockets on the rocket. Sounds like a great idea. Where do you want to put that? On the side. That's centralized? It is, but only one went on there. Somewhere around there in the middle, hopefully. That works out to be middleized. Put on some side tanks. Well, that's not snapped to it. Get them lined up with the other tanks. Now they're a little high. I don't want to fidget with this too much. I'd like to have a symmetric ship. Good enough. Hurt my feelings. Some more of those. Now we're quadrupled the power. Oh. We're going to have to strut it up. And then let's do the top in a similar fashion. Not that. Somewhere around in there, I imagine. Got one of those. 
There's a pie. Eh. Eh. Did that go on straight? Guess so. You get motors up or up underneath it without clipping? Yes. You know, I think I want another tank here. So I can put these up here. live with that. Need to strut it up. How we doing here? Wow. That's impressive. What are we doing here? No soup for you. What? What? It's because we don't have the thrust to leave the pad, man. We're gonna need some... some giddy-up. So... Ha-ha. Let's kick back. Oh, I'm gonna have to use these. It's a whole process. Let's do it. Hopefully, get some symmetry going. Oh, that'll work. Hope that went on straight. Looks like the magnet snap thing's working. They're not at the same height. Is that the same height? That's not. What's going on there? Man. Line it up with... Oh, but yeah, these aren't at the same height. It's the center one. So I can't just line it up. Is that about right? That's going to be close enough. Or... What, what happens... But just instead of... But just go that way. Get a couple of kickers. Kicking it. How much does that help? Doing really good there. We're about... No, we're still... We didn't change a thing. That's not right. We talking about the same ship? Oh, there. There we go. A little better, but... Yeah, we need all the... Okay. Okay. We can do that. We got them parts. Oh, I had it all ready to go. Should I just... No. That was me. I think that's lined up. Close enough. My googly eyes. Yeah. 
Maybe. I'd be alright with that. I, I like go. Let's put some some go on that. Kick it. What? So we're all right. We're further down than the ones on the side. Fix that. Or we could leave it like that. See, that's that's the design. How we doing here? That's not right. What? It got worse. Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh. Cheaters. Huh. I'm not sure I believe that. I mean... That's like 600... Per stick. Kilonewtons. All the way around. Plus. Three times. 525. That's another 1500. Hmm. It looks, it looks like it would fly. But apparently not. Maybe I don't have this. Being sorted here. Ooh. This needs to go down there, doesn't it? Or no, where was it? Those are the uh, liquid fuel. Those probably need a place of their own. Yeah. Probably need to sort that out a little bit more, but does that change anything? Yeah. Yeah, they they just they weren't being the the whole picture. Whatever. Herbal is going on. It, it it'll it'll lift. It won't be super fast. And I'm still not done. I have to strut it up. Get some cones on there for some aerodynamicness. Maybe colorize some stuff. All right. I think we're gonna make it. And where how does it say? Dang, that's a chunk. That's that's almost satisfies landing. Which is great, because this 
vehicle hopefully or you know will evolve in the next stage maybe some bigger engines on it to carry a lander there and back we'll dock in orbit and all that cool stuff all right all right i'm gonna put some struts on this and get right back to you okay so we got some struts on there also i do recall and i should have done this um, few things now, actually. So, right, I changed some colors up, just, you know, for flair, what have you. I think, what's going on here? Keep zeroing in on that part, I don't know why. It's weird, okay. The RCS, why are you doing that? What have I done to myself somewhere? I pushed a button and ruined everything. Or he thinks this is like the master piece or something. Still, I don't know why. How about just like oh. there we go. <laughs> that was weird. Okay. Um, so yeah, I strutted it up. Not sure if it's overkill or what have you. But that's done. The RCS, I think you know, having that many may cause problems. I guess you do a four symmetry. Keep it simple, stupid. However, I do realize that, you know, it may just not be enough oomph to turn this thing. And that perhaps. Or just a, a four arrangement, but maybe I should have more. Another four there for the back end, which will get jettisoned. And then these might hold their own. I don't know what, what, what would happen if. Like that. That ruin everything. I don't know. That's actually pretty centralized at launch. Worried about having some control. You know? As it should be. But other things I need to take care of real quick. Are the ejection of these. Uh, I've set these to be 80%, so the one, the three in front, three in back will fall off first, and then the two side ones. Um, where was I at? But I need to make sure that they go away from the ship. Um, and there's something I can do about that. But those little rockets, if I can remember where I would put them. They be under. Hmm. <laughs> Keep searching. There they are. Under motors. It's a good place for them. These little guys. Hopefully. Let's see here. Just need double symmetry on each side. Maybe it'll go on the other rocket. We need them facing the correct way. 
find the right button. That one. What am I looking at? There we go. I think that's... Nope, it's not facing the right way at all. Where's the start? Throw it away. Get a new one out. This way? How do I get it to face? That way. That's the one. That was rough. Hopefully that'll flower them away. That'll kick them off a little bit and that'll spread them out. That, you know, it's the intention. Camera's in the way. How you doing? I think that's correct. Good enough. It's okay if they spin a little as they go out. Just need them to get away from the ship. Hopefully that's enough. Where'd they all go? There they are. So I need to make sure... That they all go... Now that's got to go down here. Yeah. And then... All these... Yep, need to... Alright, yeah, we need to do some stuff here. It's a decoupling of all six of those. Needs to be way down here. Or these need to go with that decoupling. Yes. And then we need to figure out where that decoupling needs to go. There. Hopefully I'm getting all of them. Should be 12. What are these then? Oh yeah, there's 14 because there's 8 all together. 7. What? I'm confused. I don't know how to count. Two, four, six on that side. Six on the other side makes twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen there ought to be. Did two of them get down here? They did. I hope I did that right. Now all these need to be on stage one with these release. All this. <laughs> Can go away, excuse me. See the sun doing something out there, but not here. It's weird that the shadow's going that way. Oh, that's not a shadow of the sun moving. That's the overhead crane moving. But yeah, this sh the shade has been moving across slowly. Tons 
Time's going by out there and there's no pause button. And this. Does it pause when I do that? No. Nope. Keeps moving. Hold that thought, because... Alright, yeah, just a couple of things that I noticed that, right? Um, yeah. These side ones are at 80%, so they need to fall off or so. 14 there and 2 there to jettison with that. So we start off all those fire. I think we're ready to go. That goes. Then those will fire at the same time that those release. Then just a moment later we'll get rid of those two on the side. Do we need... Wait a minute. Oh... Yeah, there's two more that we need. Those two. Need to be up here. Right, there's four rockets, or two rockets per booster. Tricky. Okay. Those will dislodge. Then hopefully the liquid fuel on the side tanks will burn out at about the same time as the center tank. It needs to be its own thing just in case. This one here. I mean the side ones may go longer than the center one. But I can't get rid of the center one until the side ones go. And just in case the side ones go out substantially before that. And either way. That's correct. And then we can burn those three motors to stabilize our orbit. Get us to the moon. Get us into orbit there. And get us back. All in that upper stage. Which... I could take another t moment to find out if that's really going to be sufficient. How that breaks down. Will this get us to orbit? That gets us to the moon and back. Or will I have to take some of this with me to the moon? Looking all stupid and lanky. Ah, so many questions. Hold on. I think we're ready to start test flying this thing. I think we'll make it off the launch pad. We have enough. I don't need the 10,000. All I need is 5,400 at minimum. I'll probably need more than that, but I got more than that. I think we're ready to go. Let's pick a crew. Uh, Bill's already been. Uh, let's see. Yeah, go Tim. Take Jeb. Right blow. Sure, that's a good crew. Does it really even say they're just all Kerbinauts, right? Doesn't say that they're pilots, scientists, or engineers. Maybe they'll add that. Or some sort of advancement. Leveling up of... Anyway, let's go. And again, this is testing, really, uh, to see if it'll fly. It should, as far as specs go. I haven't checked any of this stuff. Let's see if it's just going to tumble. Probably will. I think it's good to have the thrust below the center of mass. think I don't know and also don't really know if uh, I have the right proportions we're just going sometimes just gotta go can't spend all day building or you can but more what <laughs> you actually do a lot man that's a beast 
we got great audio in this, so, um, there's that. think they probably have delay in it and all that too if I stand back far enough it'll take a while to for the sound to get here thought I hit the go button is there a problem I didn't hear a delay. We got to listen for it. <laughs> wow. That's a lot of fire. Let's wait till we get a little bit of speed before we start to try and turn anything. East. See if she'll turn. A little bit. A little bit's all I'm asking. How we doing? About to lose those. Imagine we'll do some twisting. Those rockets are just gonna fall right back on the way they go. What, what did I miss? Oh, this is in a. I didn't do that right. It's worked all right. I seem to be doing all right. It's a lot less um, sound. What happened to sound? I guess we got sound. <clears throat> I was expecting for that to go away a lot. Is it because we're going so going faster than sound? Where are we at on the map? No, we're not going that fast, are we? That's our altitude. We haven't even broke the speed of sound yet. We got a long way to go. We may not even make it. Got a lot of fuel there. We're giving her all she's got. Yeah, this doesn't look good. I think my thrust of weight at this point is... I still got it in the green. Got a G of an acceleration. Do I? Just barely. That's probably my problem is I need to be more than a G. Pretty sure we're falling. Yep. We're not going to make it. Are we? No, we're not. All right. Yeah, back to the drawing board. What's that over there? Has something unrecovered? Hmm. I wanted to do that, but I meant to see if I could turn it on side and get a little bit of lifting action. There you go. Now, oh, oh, yeah, we're burning up. This is just, you know, test flight. See if this contraption would even fly. Could probably fly it a little better, but this time around it's toast. So, just go ahead and end that. 
Confirmed. <sighs> All right. So we'll see. I'm going to put that on pause for a moment. All right. So Some stuff got changed. Well, really, I added some more fuel and what? Put on these rockets down here. They're rays of four each, which give me like 700 kilonewtons each, which is better than that. Worked out. Overall, did I get a? We're gonna lift off, and we got plenty of juice. In fact, we could probably make that round trip with this, so they say. But I'm skeptical how this is gonna work. So we may not get out of the atmosphere like before. <laughs> We start off with a good uh, thrust weight ratio, but after we lose the boosters, whether they'll be enough, hopefully adding those, these four arrays gives us enough kick to keep going and we don't fall back. So let's try it. I think the crew's still going. Yep. Let's get out there. I'll save it. Oh, and that's that bloop bloop sound. It's the saving or the auto save. It's a horrible sound. Oh, dang. Yep, I see it. I got to reattach my struts, didn't I? Sure did. Okay. I was just, you know, practice. Roll it out there. Thought I did. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Straight down is good. Where are you going? Hopefully that'll not make things explode. Because it's clipping. Hopefully that'll help. Now save it. Well. A little closer to ground, so it's... I don't know. I think everything is in order. I sure hope so. We shall see. Let's go. We're go. We need the RCS. Go up. Just those those kickback boosters are so much louder than the other rockets. By the time we lose them, it's like, why is it so quiet? They're very loud. 
<laughs> Back field. I don't know if I'm loud enough to be heard over him. What's he saying? Start to turn. If I can. Oh, I might not be able to turn this beast. Giving her all she's got. Am I turning it at all? Barely. Am I going to be able to stop it from turning if it starts turning? Just barely gave it a nudge. And I got full on. Oh, you can see it. We're hammered down. About to lose those. Or six boosters. What's our speed? We Mach 1. Here we go. Get rid of them. Hopefully... Oh, that worked pretty well. So, geez, that. So quiet. I don't know. That feel, that seems like a little bit of a bug. That it's other stuff is loud. Maybe it's just oh, that worked so well. I'm going up, up and away since I have so much more to work with, and I need. What's so lumber lumbersome to go? Getting any control at all? Go, baby, go. Maybe I should have put some... Don't get too eager. Might just... Should I try laying flat? I can spin. I can just rock it back. I don't know if I'm going to be able to pull this off. Stop spinning. Turning the right way now. I think I'm trying to push it that way the S key. That's working. Barely. This is crazy. Oh yeah. If I can get going that way a little bit, it'd be great. What are all the spikes coming off of it? What the heck? Oh, those are all the Thought they would have disappeared. Better stop doing that. Here in a moment. I think I'd kill these engines. I ought to check. Yeah, I can kill those engines. Let's try a maneuver here. Work with me, baby. Oh, why does that sign want to be in my way? Go. Something like that. Won't tell me what that is. Good enough. I don't know if we have enough time to get no, ourselves in order here. Slow mover. Slide up on the target. Gosh, that's gonna... We gotta burn for 1 minute 36. So we're gonna lose these tanks. And then it'll be on those. They have much less thrust. To be a lot less mass. Come on, turn. 
Are these thrusters even working? RCS is on. Am I out of... Oh, I'm out. I didn't bring nearly enough. Good thing I started turning early. Get ourselves on the targets up there. Look at the nav ball. We'll get there. Hopefully we'll be able to leave these behind that they'll just drop back into the atmosphere. You know, we'll almost complete that or get it nice and big. Well, probably, you know, a little bit bigger than it is now. Be able to drop those and they'll fall somewhere on Kerbin. Still need to worry about adjusting our... We'll see. Maybe we'll do something sporty. Just about on the wind up. Still got a minute to go. We can probably. If I hit this, it might get out of skew and it'll take like 30 seconds to get in. That's all I'll have. So I'm just. I'm going to let it roll. Just as is. Enjoy the view or something. I will probably miss the queue. These are, engines served us well. It was a good trade-off. Am I wobbling? I think I am. I thought those things vanished when they... But they don't, obviously. They don't seem to be hurting much. Maybe it's mass that I don't want attached to my ship. Should go the other way then, from there to there. Maybe they'll fall away, wasting too much time. Ten seconds, I'm ready to burn. Let's do it. Could probably go a little early. Or just how about on time? Is there science to be had? kind of experiments. I don't want to hop out right now, but I bet. Probably do an observation, huh? Oh, well, we can get rid of that then. Okay. And that too? More? And giddy up. Drift away a little bit, maybe? Ooh. Ah. Sure, that's going to affect us a bit. Stay on target, I'm guessing. Going to the moon. Definitely look happy about it. Let's have a look see. Yep, so our tanks are going to fall. Hopefully, not on A1. Hopefully, we will make it to orbit. I don't know if it included that in the scenario. That my motors are much less. I think we're going to be all right. But we got to get up to 3,004. Halfway there. I don't think we're going to make it in that much time. Yeah, they didn't account for my smaller motors. They're like, you should be there by now, dude. Good luck with that. We will make it, I think. I think we're still climbing. Looks like this is going up. We'll, we'll get there. It's going to be fine. Hey, what's with the rickety rock? It's not very stable, I guess, huh? 
we supposed to stay on target or just let it free burn? Maybe just stable? I don't know. Just go, man, go. I think we're probably alright. Let's just call it there. It's not the orbit we were after, but it's an orbit. We don't plan on sticking around. We're going to the moon. We're not going to fall back in. We still got to line ourselves up, perhaps. Where's the moon? There it is. Oh, have a quick look around. Got some of the hair remaining. Got plenty of fuel. About 3,280 something. Just trying to work that out. Don't need that because we ran out of that a long time ago. Now it's just a module. Also, I forgot, I forgot solar panels. So that's all the electric we got. So we're not going to send any messages anywhere. Job out there, Tim. See what's going on. Get a look around. Can you spin without causing any trouble? No. Did it not work? Oh, it's working. Good. It was worth nothing because we've been there, done that. Get yourself back in. Worthless. But, we are in orbit. Let's go see if we can catch the moon without even tilting our orbit. If we just get lucky, shoot out right over there and just happen to be there when we get there. How do I make that my target? Set it as target. So, if we... Say about there. You just see what happens if we willy nilly launch into space. Something's happening there. One thousand one hundred kilometers. We need to be within what three hundred and above sixty. So less than that. Ooh, that one will miss it. We can do make adjustments. How much would that cost us? Not much. Hmm. Helen doesn't want to say how close it gets. And we are kind of polar with that. We grab it. We can totally adjust later. I could sit here and fidget with stuff. For some time, I'm sure. We're in the ballpark, and when we get out here, we could fine tune this. Good enough. In fact, if I look at this, maybe if I just do some stuff like this. I don't know what that did to that. I wasn't paying attention. I'm fidgeting. That could be alright, I think. I mean, it doesn't say how far away it is. It's pretty far. 
think we should be able to mess with that a bit. Should have left well enough alone a long time ago. What's going on with that? Something like that. Crazy. Should leave it alone. We'll fix it in the mix. That's an intercept. Like we got all this time though, but I could just hit that button there. But I should not do that, actually. Whoa. Because it takes so much time to turn this. Oh, it doesn't. Because I got a little ship now. Get on target. Oh, we're already on target. We're there, man. We're ready to go. Squiggly. Actually, though. Run on quite a bit. That's where we'll pick it up in the next one. So, the next video won't be a whole bunch of building. We'll just... Get ourselves right to the moon in the next video. I know. It's a lot of rocket building to go through. And we're just getting started, right? Anyway. In the next one. We'll see you. Fade to black. Bye.